Hey guys. I need to really stop that. Hello, this is Brenda again. Um, it's been a while since I talked to you guys. Whatever, you're going to have to deal with my guys thing because that's just how I am. Um, anyways, it's been a while since I've talked to y'all. And I just wanted to get you an update on what's going on. I'm working on rebranding my channel. So... I'm not no longer be going to be known as Wisconsin reseller. It's just going to be plain old Brenda Carter. Um, maybe I should change it to Brenda Ehlert Carter just because that's what I am on Facebook. But it's possible that might happen. Anyways, so, and then that would be different than my other YouTube channel, which is just miscellaneous sales videos, etc., etc. So, anyways, um... I am here to give you an update on what I've been up to and what I'm going to try to, not what I'm going to try to do with the channel, what I'm going to do with the channel. Where it goes, I have no idea, but where I'm going to start is, see, I'm not a merch expert. So anyways, going back to, I'm still doing some eBay, not a lot, I just, I'm I only dabble because I get an itch to go shopping and then I have to sell it. So, um, I probably need to get a little bit more listed to cover some of my costs, but that's a whole different video. Um, but anyways, what I'm going to start doing, so, uh, really should get my thoughts together before I go on a video. Um, <clears throat> Excuse me. So what I'm going to be doing is, since I am not an expert on March, I do not do six thousand dollars a month. Most months, I'm lucky to do two hundred. Um, what I would like to do to bring you guys value is I'm going to do a, some research on some common questions asked in the groups. And then I'm going to try to come on and answer those questions in the morning, morning or afternoon on my drive to or from work. And then I'll upload the video. I, unfortunately, I cannot make time to edit videos right now. So, the, unfortunately, the, so maybe I'll do them at night. I don't know. Unfortunately, at night, my, my time is taken up by merch and print on demand. So, it's hard to fit in a video, too. So, the, the car ride videos are kind of what you get out of me right now. Because that's when I'm able to make the time to do them. So, I did make a video yesterday. I did not upload it. Because, um, when I went back and listened to it, it was all kind of whiny, excusey sh stuff. Sorry, I'm going to try not to cuss either because eventually I'd like to monetize this channel. So, um, But yeah, it was all excuses like, oh, I don't have time to do this because I'm working. Okay, so what's the answer to that excuse? Get rid of the job. However, I can't get rid of the job right now because insurance is too expensive and I'm not bringing in the money. So what's the answer to that? Bring in more money. Okay, so what's the answer to that? Right now it's not YouTube because... Um, I can't, well, I shouldn't say that. Right now, it could be YouTube. It's just not direct YouTube revenue. So, um, so anyways, I don't want to sound like I'm having all whiny excuses. But what I would like to do is, like I said, I'm not an expert, but I'd like to do some research on, I'm not going to pull up common questions because I'm, I'm not willing to make the time for that, but I will look up questions I see on the group from the day before and I'll try to answer one of those one or two of those in the car with either researched answers or I'll contact someone that might know the answer that might might be willing to help or I will know the answer and be able to help you so what I don't want to come across as right now is I am not an expert, okay? I'm still trying to figure this out with everyone else. So, 
um, but I have been around long enough to know the answers on some of the stuff as well. So that is what my intention is and that's where I'd like to see this channel go and then eventually maybe it won't just be print on demand questions, it could be other questions as well um, as far as, you know, business and goal setting and staying on task. Unfortunately, I'm not always the, I'm good at goal setting. I'm not good at goal keeping. However, I just started, I bought the, um, uh, it was one of the Entrepreneur on Fire journals, the Freedom Journal maybe? It wasn't the Mastery one. It must have been the Freedom one. And I have been, there I go with the I again, but I've been really, really, really good with staying on task and at least keeping me focused with what I'm supposed to be working on. And it makes me really think about where I'm spending my time at the end of the day and what I want to get done at the beginning of the day. So um, it also forces you to think of what you are grateful for. And that is one of the biggest problems some beginning um, entrepreneurs that can't make it have is they can't, they're not grateful for what they have. They always want more. They want, I mean, and it's not bad to want more. It's more like, ooh, what's, what's the word I'm looking for? You got to be grateful for what you have while you're looking ahead. Okay, so you're not envious of the guy next door, you know, greedy. No. Um, but you're not, you know, you know, like, you know, it's this, the seven deadly sins, you know, lust. You're not lusting over the guy's wife next door and you're not, um, you're not envious, you know, you're not envious of what you don't have, what, what the next person has. And so... It's really hard to think that way and change your way of thinking, but when you can, it really, it just, it puts you in a better mood, you're more productive, you're looking forward, um, you know, overall, it just, it's going to help you move forward in your business or in your, um, in your hustle, so... Actually, what I think I'm going to do for tomorrow is, and this might be a little controversial for a second video, is I've been wanting to do a video on the difference between an entrepreneur and a hustler. Not a hustler as in magazine, but a hustler as in um, somebody who's trying to make a buck off of an opportunist you know you're trying to take advantage of opportunities that are available to you but not necessarily an entrepreneur and I think that's what I'm gonna make my video about tomorrow because you know I don't necessarily consider what I'm doing it's a business yes okay I'm, I'm not getting into that right now so just tune in tomorrow for my my personal definition of entrepreneur versus opportunist. So, on that note, um, well, you've got about two more minutes with me. So, on that note, I am going to kind of cover where I've been with merch, with Amazon merch, what I've been doing with other print-on-demand sites, and where I see myself going within the next, I'm going to just say, the next week because um, that's kind of a short-term goal of mine. Actually, no, we're going to go with the next 90 days. So within 90 days, my ultimate goal is to be at 1,000 listings because I am, I'm not close to tearing up, but I'm at about 850 total sales, so I need about 150 more to tear up. I've been selling pretty well lately, anywhere, at least by my standards, you know, obviously not by someone who has 10,000 listing standards, but I've been going anywhere. My most this week was nine sales. My worst day was 
I think I did have a zero in the last seven days and then all of a sudden I had one zero and then I shot up to nine the next day. It was very bizarre, but very welcome. So, so that's why I have to admit that I am not an expert. I am just trying to trudge along in this print on demand life like everybody else. So my 100 day goal is to be at 1000 listings. My daily goal is to get at least 10 brand new Merch by Amazon listings done. Whether that's taking an existing design and putting it on a hoodie or a t-shirt or, or a premium shirt or a long sleeve shirt. Um, or it's brand new designs that I've made or that I've come up with. Or even, well, those are pretty much the only two. Or relists of stuff that's fallen off because of the 90 day rule, which is still in effect for a lot of the stuff that was listed previously. Of course, anything new, you know, is going up to 180 days. So, so yeah, there is my goal. And to my, tune in tomorrow for my, um, entrepreneur versus opportunist slash um, opportunist slash self-employed you know that type of thing so anyways see you all tomorrow thanks for tuning in like comment subscribe and if you liked anything I said feel free to the the links below they are affiliate links so um, you know I, I would like to I shouldn't say that that way. You know, if you like my content, feel free to click on them, make a purchase. If you don't like my content, don't click on it and make a purchase anyway and support the programs I'm talking about. So I will see you all tomorrow and have a great night, everyone. Bye.